my number one top tip for getting your grade up is your definitions. Now, when it comes to the definitions, these get overlooked by students the whole time because everybody hates definitions. Absolutely everyone hates them, but it doesn't matter. They're worth 10% in your exam minimum. So if you learn off your definitions word for word perfect, well, there's 10% in the bag. This is particularly important for those of you in fifth year who were a bit wishy-washy on your definitions going into your summer exam and just kind of thought, ah, it'll be grand. I understand what it is. And sure, I'm sure the right words will come out in the end. They never do. So make your flashcards, learn your definitions, and then suddenly you'll build up that 10% very rapidly. So my recommendation with your definitions is do one definition every single night and you'll be amazed at how quickly that will contribute to your marks in tests and exam questions. Next, my second top tip is start doing exam questions now. Ideally, you would have been doing exam questions from the start of fifth year. But if you weren't, if your teacher told you, Asher, don't bother, we'll do them in sixth year, it's really important that you start doing exam questions as early as possible. Doing the past paper questions is genuinely the fastest way to improve your grade because you'll see the language used in the question, the same questions repeat all the time, and also your examiner is looking for the same language in the answers. So by doing the exam questions, you will see every single combination of questions before you ever sit the leave insert. So you could even be answering questions now that come up in your exam in 10 months time or nine months. Next, so do all of the past paper questions and I recommend doing them by topic. So if, for example, you're doing organic synthesis in school right now, which is the stuff for question eight on the paper, make sure that you're doing all of the past paper questions for question eight. Once you've done the question closed book, no cheating, correct your answers using the correct mark scheme and repetition is key. Anywhere where you dropped marks, have another go at it and see if you can get more marks the next time. The more you do that question, the easier it's going to be to recall the keywords and phrases needed to get marks. Now, my tip for this is download the exam question booklets by topic from the Grinds360 website. So I spent a lot of time going through past papers and cutting out exam questions by topic. So if you're on the organic synthesis, download the booklet for organic synthesis and every synthesis question is found inside there. And I did them for all the other topics as well. 